Hi everyone, this is Nicholas with Twisted Nightmare Gaming and today we got a special episode because before the Kyber Cup Grand Tournament event they gave us the Stardust Nexus deck which is, lo and behold, unlocking Shooting Star Dragon with his own unique effect which is, which hilariously allows me to add certain things in the graveyard it allows a jump converter, a stardust dragon, and a form of the synchron that you can add out of the deck. As you can read, it starts with a converter in the graveyard, and it is as long as I can get a stardust on the field, as long as I have at least X amount of cards that synchron or stardust cards, I can just special summon a form of the synchron from outside the deck to go straight into shooting star. Surprisingly enough, this deck works really fast. So let's get quick into a quick match and show it off. I'm not doing a deck loadout because minor tweaks to the deck itself, but I would give a deck loadout at the end. But it's I've done a light tweakings to what you get from just buying the special deck out itself. So this is the effect with the new Stardust art promo. So as long as I have the required materials in my deck and extra deck, it will allow me to trigger the extra effect. So I now have a Stardust on the field. So activate skill, shooting star road to activate. And I get a special summon uh, form of the Synchron outside of this deck. And then straight into shooting star dragon by turn two for me. And lo and behold, look at it. Look at the effect that they have for the visuals. Now, if you didn't know, Shooting Star Dragon has a nice little effect that you can trigger it and it excavates the top five cards. And for every two minute it excavates, it can attack at one extra turn. But the caveat if you don't excavate any tuners, guess what it does? Not get to do attack. And just like that with Shooting Star Dragon's effect, it's a quick win. So, 
let's go over the deck itself. So the changes I have made to this deck, which is I added Junk Servant, Junk Forward, another Junk Anchor, one Junk Changer, and the Staple cards. But I also added the Stardust Flash, Shooting Star, and Respark, or Stardust Respark to the main deck. For the extra deck, it comes with Shooting Star, Stardust Dragon, Junk of not Junk to Berserker, it comes with some of the other cards, but Junk Berserker is an interchange, Junk Warrior comes with, Formula Synchron is what it comes with, Stardust Assault Warrior is a change, and number 39 Utopia is a change. This was because of the special event to, special, to get one of the main villains from 5Ds, but yeah, so it came with summoning up to 10, 8, 7, 5, and 4, like it, the deck itself came with Junk Archer, which made absolutely no sense to use Junk Archer in this deck because he kind of doesn't do much and turbo warrior which again not a bad option but really doesn't do much where is a turbo warrior huh. now if it came with a junk destroyer i would put junk destroyer also in here but berserker and Starter Assault Warrior is a really good option because Starter Assault Warrior allows me, if I synchro summon him and he's the only one I have on the field, I can special summon a card from my graveyard. And again, with how this specific effect works for this skill, he's a nice quick level 8 strain to Stardust. But yeah, this is how this deck is. And it's not too bad really it's simple quick fast easy to pick up easy to play not bad to understand so catch you guys in the next time peace